Because I've been cut so many times, it feels like I forgot what it feels like to feel. And as the days go by, I just grow cold hearted. A senseless soul as I send my goodbyes to another sister who is martyred. Paint a picture of a perfect world which is nothing short of distorted. Nothing short of a disguise to try to hide all the lies from behind of all the children dying. As a little girl cries, Ana Aisha, Ana Aisha, I'm alive, I'm alive, I can't believe I'm breathing. See, we're alive too, sweetie, but our hearts aren't really beating. See, every time I hear you scream on the screen, I'ma quickly get to leave and hit the X, please. I mean, I really need to sleep this evening. I mean, how can I sleep while I watch her bleeding? How can I turn the heat on my heaters while I watch her freezing? So if I hear her screaming one more time, I'ma hold my breath and close my eyes and pretend to be dumb, deaf, and blind as I hope to death. She doesn't die, failing to realize that our silence is a crime that is lethal. As we sit and blame God for the problem of evil, aren't you the all-powerful? Please turn it back to peaceful, despite the fact you gave us all that we needed to free these people. But are we even people? And are we all really equal? Or is it okay so as long as it doesn't happen to you? As videos gain views all over YouTube and we see them die all day. All over the news as we sit at home so confused. Still not sure what to do but to hang our heads in despair. As we watch vids of kids struggling for air. Screaming to God hoping that he's there. See, God's right here. But you, you were where? The only reason he let you watch them suffer was to see if you care. He gave you all this food you never needed just to see if you share. He gave you all this money too just to see if there's a dollar you would spare. But you would hold on tightly, daily and nightly. Living life as a dream, hopeful of what it might be. But what does life mean apart from amusement and play? Pastimes and pleasures that are destined to fade away. Left us all deluded, thinking we're going to take this all into our graves. Nay, live life as a traveler and only take what you need along the way. It's only going to leave you empty-handed apart from the deeds you sow today. From the struggle you put forth and the charity you chose to pay. So what have you prepared for that day when we stand shaking and scared? Sweating to our knees and the newborn is brought gray-haired as we are brought forth to our Lord. Ya Allah, I seek justice, screams the girl we ignored. From an ummah that had forsaken me despite all the times I had called. From the rubble I had roared and I roared. Ya Allah, I seek justice from the wealth they would hoard. From an ummah that neglected the hungry and the poor, that slept on a full stomach while we were left starving next door. Ya Allah, you're my witness, I couldn't take it anymore. I was cold and clothless as I slept naked on the floor. Ya Allah, I seek justice from all the pain that was caused. Wasn't that worth more than all the shopping sprees at the stores and the money splurged at the malls? So if you're still breathing, know that there's people needing your support. I'm pleading to please give, and if you've already given, please give some more. For it's not to save their lives at all, but by our hearts to save yours. Give. Zakwa